All right, now to America's fentanyl crisis. The Drug Enforcement Administration adding several new cartel members to its most wanted list. They're accused of helping flood the U.S. with hundreds of thousands of doses of that deadly narcotic. Jorge Ventura joins us live. Jorge, we've been talking about this story for a while. We've covered it from the beginning. Who are these men uh, that they're looking for? Hey, good morning to you, Nick. So the DA is now focusing on the top operatives for a criminal organization called Los Chapitos. This criminal group is controlled and ran by, by the infamous drug lord, El Chapo. And according to federal officials, Los Chapitos played a massive role in the trafficking of fentanyl for the Sinaloa cartel and are experts in getting the deadly drug into the United States. At the top of the list is Oscar Noel Mendinez Gonzalez. He is a principal deputy for one of the sons of El Chapo and the organization's commander of security. Medina Gonzalez is a seasoned hitman who reportedly expanded drug trafficking territory for Los Chapitos and is a high-level leader for the Sinaloa cartel. He is now charged with protecting the export routes of fentanyl. Second on that list is Kun Jiang, a Chinese citizen who supplies the Sinaloa cartel with chemicals used for manufacturing fentanyl. In September of 2021, Kun Jiang allegedly sold 25 kilograms of fentanyl chemicals to the Sinaloa cartel. The chemicals were flown from China to Mexico and were seized by Mexican authorities. He faces a long list of charges, including fentanyl trafficking conspiracy. Well, Jorge, right, hold up. Before you go, what sort of challenges does Kun Yang's uh, arrest pose for federal officials? And who is the final person on their takedown list? So Kun Jing will be a difficult arrest for the DEA uh, because he is a Chinese national and so far federal officials do not have an extradition agreement for Kun Jing at this moment. Meanwhile, the DEA is also still looking for one of the main traffickers of fentanyl for the Sinaloa cartel. You are looking at him right there and that is Luis Javier Benitez Espinoza, a.k.a. L14. And according to federal officials, he's trafficked thousands of doses of fentanyl into the U.S. through San Diego, and he is under the direct orders of Los Chapitos. Together, the feds are offering about $6 million for the arrest of these three men right now, Nick. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.